Good morning, Shana. Well, it certainly is cold, and of course, with that winter weather advisory in effect, it may only get colder with that expected snow that Curtis was talking about. And uh, I am live here near Sherman Hill in Des Moines, and take a look at this. This is something we all noticed on our drive in this morning, and you'll likely notice it too. You see the kind of dry, whitish coating on the streets going in both directions here. That is the brine that these city crews have already put down to hopefully keep the roads safe and not quite as slick when the snow does start. The DOT is also going to be out as well, treating the interstates and other main highways, and they're planning the schedules now to make sure they have plenty of plow drivers on hand to clear that snow. We have plenty of salt on hand, and uh, our drivers have been out doing practice runs to make sure that they know the routes well and making sure that all of our equipment is functioning properly. I sure hope it's all functioning properly because this could be the first more measurable snow, if you will, on Saturday. Um, I do want to tell you quickly about KCCI's weather app. It is free in your app store. It's free. It's a great resource, especially now when we're looking at some of this weather that could um, get kind of messy. You can get the hourly forecast on that. Check um, that interactive radar exactly where you live. And I think one of the more important things, too, with this new app is the fact that it's going to give you those alerts, again, so you can stay ahead of the storm.